Okay, everybody got everything you need? Got something to drink? All right, well, set yourself down. Get ready. I'm going to show you a few of the slides from our vacation. That was a good dinner, wasn't it? Yeah, 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 yeah. Thank you very much. I'm an excellent cook. huh? <laughs> yeah, three weeks after we were married, I learned I better start cooking in self-defense. Speaking of self-defense, I'll tell you what. I was worried about that. I was thinking I'd have to go out and take a judo class or something like that once you found out what I spent on that camera we took on this vacation. These slides are magnificent. But you can't afford it. I couldn't afford it. I'll be paying for it for the rest of my life. So trust me. <laughs> no, seriously. But it is beautiful. In fact, it was that Susie, my, our daughter, said that... Um, when we got started, when she saw some of the pictures, and she asked me, she said, you know, Dad, is that real? I don't think she really understood the concept of that. Maybe when she's 14, she'll, she'll start to figure that kind of thing out. It, it was nice. It was nice. I have never in my life, i got to be honest with you, I've never in my life seen more rain. I thought it rained here. I thought it rained when I was down in Texas. And it does. I mean, it rains, you know, drops the size of a, of a quarter, for goodness sakes. But down there, it rains all the time. Is there a picture in there where we're not all bundled up? I don't think there is. We're all wearing those, you know, the yellow slicker or whatever the heck they got to put on to go out there. But yeah, we've got. Uh, we went up to see uh, who was it? Aunt uh, Aunt Marge and Uncle Jack, Jane's uh, kin up there. They've been up there for quite a few years. You know, some of the family went down to Southern California when they left out of Ohio, and some of them came up into the Northwest. So we went up to uh, we went up north. We've been south, uh, you know, a couple three years ago. We went out. What was it to one of the to one of the falls? And in fact, one of the kids when we uh, when we went up there because they all took us out on the boats, and uh, you know, we go down for a picnic someplace and out to one of the little islands or or something. Cause they're magnificent country, just absolutely spectacular. Still some snow-capped mountains off into the background, which was really nice and really, really different. Living out in the flatlands, the kind of stuff that you don't really get a chance to see. One of the things that really hit me, you know, I worked that office, and we got, what, 30 desks in one room, gray metal desks with black phone, black typewriter, and we were all wearing black suits, black ties, white shirts, black shoes, black socks. Holler Joe and three guys lift their heads up and say, Yes, can't tell anybody from six miles away. And we're out there. <laughs> and Charlie, he's a friend of the family. Everybody calls him Uncle Chuck. He comes out there, he comes right after church, he comes out to the lake, gets his little boat out, fires that son of a gun up. I look over him running that thing, and he's still dressed in his Sunday best. And I talked to him. I said, what is he doing? I said, he's coming out here because he just wanted to see. He said, no, he comes out here every single Sunday dressed up in that suit. They said it's one of those things that just makes him feel good. And at his age, I guess, you know, he needs that. But it does. He was, he was happy as a clam. He was happy as an absolute clam. And I couldn't believe it because, of course... Getting up and going to work is that piece of unreality for me that only allows me to come home. Being up there back in the woods like that, it just makes you think, makes you realize that back in the time when a man could just drop a pole in the water and pull out a fish for dinner, or he could grab his rifle and tramp through the woods of an evening to get an elk and have some meat for the week. That was real. It seems more real than the pictures on that tube, or even the pictures on this screen, and I was there. So I know how real it was. I know how it felt. But seeing the shadows of reality on this screen make me realize that there are a thousand different realities Important to us, important to everyone. Dah, it's enough of that stuff. <laughs> hey, I got peach pie, I got more brandy.